Well, a point at home to send out from your, what's your thoughts on the game? Overall, probably frustrated. Said to the boys in there that we we'll obviously put a, a good shift in against a, a very stubborn Stenhouse Muir team. They came here, we knew what we were going to be up against after the last time we, we went up there. And uh, I think I thought we caused ourselves problems at times. We were defending in the opening 15 20 minutes. Obviously, we conceded a poor goal, but you know, credit to the boys for coming back into the game and showing the character, getting the goal through Josh Todd, who was missing last week. And then it's just about looking at positives. It's uh, another point picked up at home. Our home form is relatively good, only getting beat once in six games. We'd have liked three points, but um, like I say, the reaction from last week was was massive and the boys showed a bit of character to today to take something from the game. Yeah, like you say, um, losing five one to Stenny earlier in the season and obviously a disappointing away result to Alwa last week. So uh, yeah, Slightly happy about a point uh, after a disappointing run. Every every point, you know, is going to be important this year in a very competitive league. But disappointed didn't get three because I thought that we dominated the second half. Sometimes, you know, maybe vulnerable to the long ball or the counter attack because of the way I have the team set up to play. We're quite open and expansive, um, and when we give the ball away at times cheaply, the the turnover can be um, costly. But like I said, it is a point at the end of the day. Would we like to see? Yes, but we take it and we move on to another home game next week. Good to see Paul Smith back. Great to see Paul Smith and Hooper uh, coming through 90 minutes. Paul has been a big miss. Um, he had a terrific Premier Sports Cup. Good start to the season and then a bad injury, so really important. And again, when I talk about taking the positives from the game, that's Paul Smith back, uh, Scott Hooper back with no reaction. A point at home and like I said, a building block for next week.